Let me quickly share this here. If you're looking for a simplest way to cut your bra cup cover or your bra cup lining, this is how you are going to go about it. So this is uh, my ready-made bra cup. I'm making use of my ready-made bra cup. And I have gone ahead to use this lining and I folded this lining into four equal parts, okay? I folded it into four equal parts. I am just using this as an illustration. I'm not making use of the lining. So you, when you get your bra cup, just fold it up like this. Like you see me folding up this ready-made bra cup. You can see I folded it up. Okay. Now I'm going to go ahead and place it on the lining that I just folded into four. Like this. And I am going to go ahead and cut out after, after placing it. Okay. Now while cutting, I'll be adding my allowance. Please add your allowance, allowance for stitching and uh, allowance for the turning up with the lining. So after cutting this out, it's going to be four pieces, okay? After cutting it out, I'm going to be having a four pieces for this. Two for the lining, that is two in one, two in one. Let me just call it one for the lining and one for the main fabric, which is the covering of the bra cup, like we normally do. So please, after cutting, I am going to go ahead and notch. Make sure you notch your own. This place you saw me notch is the place that, that the bra cup was covered. The place that I folded the bra cup up. So that will be the place I'm going to be stitching on my sewing machine, okay? I'll just place it like this and stitch it around. So the purpose for notching is for me to know the exact place to uh, stitch up, okay? So let me just show you what I just did here. I placed this ready-made bra cup and you can see that I have my extra allowance there. This is just an illustration. I'm just decided to share with us. And uh, you can see that I have an allowance. While cutting yours, please put your allowance, okay? Just um, 0 0.7 inches allowance will be okay. Now, after sitting it up, this is what I have here. You can see uh, that it's looking so beautiful. I have one for the lining and one for the main fabric, which is the covering of the bra cup. And this is how it's going to be sitting on the bra cup. Let's just say this one is for the main fabric, okay? After inserting it, I'll be using the other one to turn it up. You can see it here. So I'm going to use this one to turn it up, but I'm not making use of this. I just decided to show us how you can quickly do this instead of drafting or cutting the way you normally do your own. Hope this is helpful, okay? If you love this, please don't forget to share. Thank you and see you on the next tutorial. Bye.